using the electromagnetic wave, Microwaves, by kscience.com. Microwaves are used in cooking. So if you put some soup in the microwave and turn it on, the microwaves are going to transfer energy to the water molecules inside the food. So the energy is transferred to the thermal energy store of the water molecules. And then the water molecules are going to transfer the energy from its thermal store to the thermal store of the food. So remember, microwaves transfer energy to the thermal store of water molecules. The water molecules transfers energy from its thermal energy stores to the food's thermal energy stores. That causes the temperature of the food to increase. It's question time. Attempt these questions to check your understanding. Let's now see how microwaves are used in communications. So this here is the upper atmosphere of the Earth's atmosphere. And what I'm drawing now in space is a satellite. Microwaves use satellites to transmit microwave signals around the Earth. Let's say we're transmitting a television signal from South America. This microwave transmitter is going to emit microwaves of that television signal to a satellite. This microwave is going to pass through the Earth's atmosphere into space and the satellite is going to amplify and retransmit that microwave back down to Earth. So this television signal in the form of a microwave signal is going to be and the satellite is going to amplify and retransmit that microwave back down to Earth and a satellite dish is going to receive that microwave signal. So this person with the satellite receiver is going to be able to watch television from South America. This is because that television signal has been transmitted to the satellite and then back down to Earth to the person's satellite receiver. So the uses of microwaves in communications are satellite TV, satellite phones, the internet and military communication. That satellite TV, satellite phones, internet and military communications. It's question time. Attempt these questions to check your understanding. Press pause to practice using those key words. The answers will follow. Press pause to go through your answers and make any corrections to your mistakes. Press pause to answer the questions. The answers will follow. And if you're stuck, just rewatch the video. Press pause to go through your answers and make any corrections to your mistakes. Visit kscience.com for more free videos, worksheets, and quizzes at kscience.com. And don't forget to like and subscribe.